Ladies and gentlemen, you are watching Richard Reviews Children's Books, and I have for you today That's Our Teacher by Ann Morris. And this is a book designed to humanize teachers. You know, it's about a real teacher, actual classroom, photographs, not illustrations so much. Again, I don't know how entertaining this book is going to be. It is very much just a factual account of teachers. So you have to ask yourself, well, does my child have a problem humanizing their teacher? Do they have a problem thinking about the fact that their teacher is a person that may have a significant other, may have children, may be someone you'd run into the grocery store? If they do, this is a great book for that. This is for very young children, preschoolers maybe. Uh, this may help children acclimate to the concept of school. If they're just about to go, you might pick this book up and say, look, see, teachers aren't so bad, they're just people like you and me, and everything's going to be fine, you're going to make lots of friends, and all that. Being all in all, there's not much to say about this particular volume, and that, that's a common problem with children's books. Being again, I could point to the fact that it's a pretty, pretty solid design, but it's got the abnormal length, so it's more of a... It feels like it should be like this, but it's not. And I don't know why they did that, and they even, even put this artwork here to make it look like a child put it together. And in the back, there are suggestions for how to help your teacher, or how to appreciate your teacher, and all that sort of business. So all in all, I mean, I can't say anything particularly bad about this book. There's no, well, I mean, you should be conscious of this. No, no. Perfect book, fine for just about anybody. The question just is, are your children going to really enjoy it? And I don't see much in this book that would really tickle a child's fancy. It's not a fanciful book of that nature. But, again, solid enough. Anyway, that's my opinion. I'd love to hear yours. Down in the comments below, I am Richard.